welcome to our channel yeah guys situation right now it's a lot but yeah how are you doing Hannah? are you good say i'm good <laughs> hey guys so yeah, the weather is a bit gloomy it's like raining um i'm going to work today yes i'm going to work like this i'm going to drink my medication and hopefully in a couple of hours it's going to be better or at least before i do my makeup it's going to be better you guys know by now that i will not miss work because of this allergy no 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 close the door close the door i managed to make breakfast and then i'm going to call an uber hey. Hey, i need to make finish making food um and then go to my hairstylist to go install the wig and then go to the urban studios to go and get my makeup done and we are shooting at Rima Bubble Church today. Why are you being like that? Hmm? Hmm? Why are you being like that? Studios. I'm in reception. Just had a meeting with the team, and they decided that I can't shoot obviously because I look like this, and I can't shoot without makeup. And if I put makeup on, it can just trigger and make it worse. So they phoned the other presenter, and they're gonna fetch him now and go to the shoot. So just requested an Uber to go back home and just walk towards it. I think he's here. Um, so yeah, like I want to cry so badly. Like I'm so sad. I'm so sad. I'm really sad. Hey guys, so it's been a couple of hours since I or since you last saw me and I am with the kids Hello. and they are done Hello. out to go get Beggar King. Kanya knows how to say the boys' names which is so so cute. Kanya? Kanya? Ir Karula? Yes. Kanya? Ir Kamu? Kamu? Good girl. Kanya iri daddy? Daddy. Kanya iri mama? Daddy. Mama. Kanya, ah, batung. Kanya iri mama? Ay. Say mommy. Hello. Thank you, my baby. She's so smart. She is so smart. You guys, like, the medication I take for this allergy, actually, the side effects you, like, Gain um, weight on your face, Mommy. on your stomach, Mommy. you have back pains and headaches. So, this is why Mommy. I had literally stopped My taking it, but right now Mommy. I can't I'm stop anymore. Right and Mommy. literally have to make peace Mommy. with this. Not only the swelling, but the weight gain as well. Uh, are you calling me? Are you calling me? <laughs> We're at Burger King to come and get some lunch. And also, Burger King has vegan food. I had no idea, so we're gonna walk in. And? I did find plant based stuff on the menu. I'm um, going to show you guys shortly. I hope it tastes good. Because ah. they got me as a customer. Is it something called an Easter fast? Yes. Oh, okay. How did you know about an Easter fast? A recent. Research? Mm -hmm. Okay. Can I taste your ice cream? <laughs> okay. Hold on, let me just do this. The ice cream looks so cr um, creamy. Uh, mountain Dew. Seat belts, everybody. Mountain Dew. It's a bit shaky, but 
I want to quickly show you what I bought. So I bought um, plant-based nuggets. Guys, please check if my sauce is not in there. So vegan. Um, oh, there's a garlic mayo here. Let me just check the ingredients for me. If this mayo doesn't have eggs. Ingredients, vegetable vinegar, yeah. So this one doesn't have eggs. Sorry guys if it's shaky. Mm -hmm. Mommy, is this not, is this no eggs. I don't, I don't know. So, because yep, it has eggs. It has eggs, Okay. Most mayos have egg unless if it's like vegan mayo. Like this one, the sauce is a garlic sauce, but it's like vegan, so it doesn't have eggs. Let's taste the nuggets. Can you taste if this is chicken or not? This one's yellow. This one's. Can you taste? Let me taste, right? <laughs> That's the thing about vegan stuff. It's so advanced. Like unlike vegetarian stuff, it vegan vegan meals actually taste like meat. My mistake. Mm. I also dropped it. Um, so and then I got mozzarella sticks for Kanyam. You guys know I absolutely love this. I loved it from when I was in New York. Love, love, love deep fried cheese of any sort. So they have like these mozzarella sticks. Look at that. That's all cheese. Mm. So these are actually put for Kanyam. She's eating one right now and she's enjoying it. Mm. Mm. I think you guys have seen me eating this before on the channel, definitely. <coughs> Mass, come take Kanya. So, and then. Eat your mega little sticks. Baby, eat them. They're so tiny. Uh -huh. I thought it's bigger. Mm. This is a chili cheese plant based burger. Okay. Um, I love the chili cheese sauce. It's got jalapeno, so it's just super cheesy. And then this is the plant-based patty. Believe it or not, guys, this is not meat. Let me taste it because the chicken nuggets are wow. Sorry, guys, I got interrupted by the call, but I took a bite while I was on the call. Like, there's no way this patty is not meat. Mm. Guys, can you please holla at me? <laughs> because this is not a paid post, but wow. I know a lot of people who love vegan meals like me. I definitely want to go because I had no idea. They even they even offer vegan meals like wow. Mm. Wow. Mm. Mm. One thing about food, it will make you feel better. Not sure how long it will make me feel better for, but I feel better that I'm with my family, that I'm with my children, and that I've eaten. So I just want to watch like a nice movie that's going to make me forget what I'm going through, like a good two hours of just escaping. I think that's also that's the reason why I love movies so much just hold the camera guys by the way this is the new um this is the new r50 it's a new vlogging camera by canon absolutely amazing that's what i'm actually vlogging with this entire vlog so you guys let me know if you see the difference from like my previous vlog and this one because i'm absolutely loving how crisp it looks so the viewfinder is there and the camera that i use which is the g7x yeah g7x the viewfinder is on top of the camera so i would normally be looking there which is you know but now it's there so i forget that i need to look here so i'm sorry about that but let me know if you guys notice the difference it's currently available in pre-orders at auto photo so if you have been budgeting for new vlogging equipment please do consider the camera yeah let me go inside and finish eating and then try and watch a good movie i wish my cc was here 
so we can cuddle and she'll give me like some positive vibes because today I felt zero 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 motivation zero uh, positive vibes because I just found myself at a very low point where now my work is being affected by this allergy that's number one costing me a lot of money number two now I'm unable to work to make money because of the allergy so yeah let me go inside guys a mustache who has an ice cube mustache does somebody have an ice cube mustache huh switch off the lights no sit down sweetie sit down <gasps> do you have an ice cream mustache? Yes, you do. She's mixing cheese snacks and ice cream. Look how messy that is. Kanya, love you. I love you. <laughs> no, 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 don't go there. Your ice cream is melting, Kanya. It's melting. Bye. Uh. Bye. <laughs> Good morning, my loves. Why is it so dark? Because I'm right by the window. There's not enough um, natural lights. But anyway, I want to show you my outfit. I am obsessed with clothes that I wear or tops that I wear and that don't need a bra. My favorite. Because they're so comfortable. You've got like nothing going like the whole day. And this is one of them. It's cute, isn't it? It's also nice that after three children, I've got boobs like this. Don't take that for granted. I appreciate it. Um, wait, let me just go to the other door. Yeah, so Camarello and Carlo no. chew like they are chewing gum. Like you chew like you are chewing gum. Me? Yes. Please. I teach you guys how to do that. Anyway, today we're going to um see the infection is still there, but I don't know if it's an infection, but the allergic reaction is still there, but it's so much better than yesterday. Mm. I think if it was if it was like this yesterday, I would have totally just um gone to the shoot, but okay, that didn't happen. Let's let it go. And then today I'm going to a theater play. I'm going to watch one of my friends that I studied with at AFTA. And then after that, I'm going to celebrate my sister-in-law's birthday at Fire Room. Guys, you know that it is Auntie Sharon's birthday during the week. Oh yeah, she did say happy birthday, right? So we're going to Fire Room today and it's going to be nice. And I'm going to take you guys along. See you guys what I'm making for breakfast. So these are cheese grillers. They sell them at Spa. They're really, really good. Um, so yeah, if you're a fan of cheese grillers, this is a plug, honey. Carole, please give me the rolls there. And Carole is just making breakfast. Why aren't you eating cereal? Hmm? Why aren't you eating cereal? I need something else. Something else. You can have that for lunch. Anyway, then we bought like hot dog rolls. And then I bought like mustard. It's not something that we normally buy at my house. But I recently bought mustard. Specifically for the hot dogs. Um, so yeah. See how this turns out. <laughs> Guys, let me show you. Look at my son's toast. He put so much butter underneath that slice of bread. Like it's not even funny. Maybe we can see the amount of butter that's on that bread. Okay, I don't know if you guys can see that yellow butter. And let me just show you guys this while I wait for him to finish. Um, Carlo, did you take your mints? These are Carlo's mints. Oh, and then these shoes. are mine. Because yeah. you guys remember? Okay, so look at my son's feet. So that's the right to go. Let me see the other side, my baby. Turn it's around. actually getting better though. Is it getting better? It looks like it's getting worse to me. Like in the middle of your feet, there was nothing and now it's there. Now it's going to your toes. You need to cut your toenails, okay? okay. Or else you're going to look like Maudwana. <laughs> Akur. Chicken feet. Anyway, yeah. Look at that. Can you all see all these spots that were not there before? Yep. That's why he's taking off these mats. And that's what the toes look like. I must admit, it looks yummy. Very. <laughs> and I made mine. Russian in the air fryer because I'm trying to be healthy. 
One thing about me, honey, you cannot keep a good girl down, guys. I feel like genuinely, I'm like, yeah. I'm like, woo, chair, woo, chair. What's that song? I was just like listening to an Instagram. Baby, my Valentine. Hey, but be honest, hey, 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 not ever. You cannot keep this one down. You gotta bring them allergies. You gotta bring them over challenges. She's still gonna pray for her. She's still gonna be happy. She's still gonna wake up. She's still gonna say life is good. She's still gonna say God is good because that's what time is. Just saying. <laughs> Look who's back from church. Look who's back from church. Hi, sweetie. Hey, where you going? Kanya. Kanya, where you going? Hi, sweetie. Where you going? Give me a hug. Kanya. Hey, Oh, twinkle, 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 little star. Woo, my girl. Yes, they're back from church. <laughs> guys so we are en route to the constitutional hill to go watch oh yes i actually did tell you guys to go watch a play so my sister is here you know say hi hi guys welcome to meeting my sheila's channel nancy face so guys my sister was so kind enough yesterday I mean, you guys saw all the drama unfolding yesterday. Um, so kind of her to take Hanya with to her house. I think I have to turn the, I have to turn here. So she came to my house and then she took Hanya. Turn right on Victoria Avenue, M9. Um, so we're almost here. So but what I shot for like fine. So we're going to yeah. So anyway, you know took Kaya because I mean she saw that I wasn't okay. You know, I was just so sad and so down, you know, and I was just like it, it wasn't it wasn't a good day for me. So she took she came to take Kaya, I think around 9 p.m. And then she's like, Sissy, I want you to rest, I want you to take it easy. You know um which was so 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 thoughtful of her and i think that's the blessing about having a twin sister it's because whatever emotion you feel they feel as well so i think she could sense as much as i'm i'm always like acting strong and whatever i think she could feel that i'm on zero and she's like nope take time out rest i'll look after your daughter and then i'll bring her tomorrow so that's the reason why, almost there that's the reason why you saw Hanya coming from church with her i didn't even go to church meters, i just left. slept and, and just left. Took it are you watching this so thank this? you so much for that cc i welcome. appreciate you so much for that um and i can't wait until you finish with your house and move in so that it can, can happen more up. often <laughs> <laughs> you won't have to bring her i'm just gonna take her yeah yes, constitutional healing by the way uh give yeah. you constitutional healing yeah um, we we'll take we must get a name Something. What? What gate? And she's okay. I'll check you guys shortly. Oh, you know, too much to carry. Anger and bitterness will only eat you faster, Jabolo. Do you want to be in a trip with like an eight-year-old? Is that what you want? <laughs> what did that boy do to you?
least one person said hi to the vlog. Inu is just taking pictures. Nobody knows me. Nobody cares about me. <laughs> Why don't you guys want to take pictures with me? And ask me, Nane. Me, I'll just stand here and, and be a spectator because nobody wants to take pictures with me. He says he knows me, but it's fine. He's just trying to be nice. And then, you know, do what you guys want. Constitutional Hill. I like that. Hey, honey. I shot her. You shot a movie here. She said, Are you getting flashbacks? I am, like, serious ones. 26 years in prison. That's 9,000. And, and this is what they were saying, Guti. Um, and then look how young he was. See, look, huh? Just look how young, how young he was until that, right? So interesting. Hello. More pictures? <laughs> this is Tata Bay. Hey, Tata. Wow, revolutionary activism. Okay, you know, taking more pictures there. This is so cool. Wow, guys. Our history is so rich. Look at this. This is look like their letters, like it's just similar to Robben Island where they've put their letters Can away. You haven't been to Robben Island? Can no. I pay for you to go to Robben mm. Island? I need mean, to go to Robben <laughs> Take I'm, my offer. I'm even embarrassed. Take to my say offer. That. I'm embarrassed to say Take that. Take my offer, girl. Oh, as South Africans, I mean, oh, what really, really makes us is our history. Um, and I think also. You know freedom day and just like celebrating that day means so much i know for other people it's just like another public holiday but i mean it holds so much significance like we are here work, walking free and really living the lives that we live because of people that fought so hard for us so i never ever take that for granted so that's cool so my sister acted in a movie what was in Colton? Colton, she was the lead. I think I told you I'm guys to share some, some pictures here so that you can see when I was actually here in the Constitution. Yeah. Guys, I oh, was the most so memorable. Fun. But I want to show yeah, you the place most memorable where time she was escaped in prison. <laughs> so, see, isn't this the passage where they were beating you? Those girls? Yeah. Here, like here where we walked when we came no. out. So, it's in the south where they were beating me. In the hey, town, yeah. my sister. She, during shooting that movie, my sister had bruises yeah. for days. You guys want to see my bag? So can you show them like my bag that I got in in Bali? Yeah. I got a few of them like this, but of in this shape. Yeah. You guys like it this outfit? Okay, wait for this. But now don't go against the light. Racism round. To the police van, right? Came this way. I remember when you got arrested. You dropped us here. Yes. Right? And then we went in there. We're taking in there. Yeah. Then straight to our cells. But before the cells, we need to go change first. Obviously, they, they give you your gear, your, guys. No! How did you escape? Show me how you ran. I ran, I ran. Ran now, ran now. I ran can't now. run anymore. <laughs> You were so say, tiny, Sissy. I was. Sissy, you were. As a you were 28, I think. Yeah, I used to eat one boiled egg. The whole. Thing. When you still ate eggs. eggs. I still ate eggs. Now I don't eat eggs anymore. Sissy, you were finished. Ate, and I used to run like 10 k's a day then. Yeah. Yeah. My director, his name is Gavin Otate, who used to be a runner and a fitness fanatic. So we used to do like challenges like 21 days running, you know, certain number of kilometers. Which helped you for the character because you had to be physically. Me so yeah. Much. So I'm grateful. I was the scene where I was sitting here and then I changed there and then I ran. That's so hectic. Then I ran out. Since I remember watching the movie and I saw like, isn't this place where they search you after you get arrested? No? Yeah, Sissy, here. but you had a walk that you did when you got arrested. Do yeah. it for me. Do, do that walk.
just got good news. The blood test came out good. Your kidneys are fine. Your heart is fine. Got it low. Yay! And you just got your McDonald's. So tomorrow is just the surgery and everything is going to go well. I am so happy. Hallelujah! May your struggles keep you I'm gonna write the lyrics down for you guys so that you can see how powerful they are. I actually like. Um, I wrote this lyric, this lyrics when I posted a post on on Instagram a few months ago when I was just. Um, can you guys like calm down? Like you're too much. Like I, I get no, I get that you're trying to distract him. But I'm trying to understand this and the dad don't need to come back here because they are just like too much. I can't imagine what you're going through. Yo. He's going to the ward now, he's gonna get a blanket because this is like the trauma emergency center. Okay. So I think no beggars got lettuce. I think lettuce. 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 That one is a bad movie. Okay, so we're leaving the hospital. And yeah, it is so hard for me to leave my child, but we had to because you can't um, stay here. There's no bed for moms. And also, I think he's a little bit old. I do. He's not like a small baby. So. But I can come at any time. <clears throat> so, yeah. And also, Gavolo, like me, is on chronic medication because he is, obviously, he's got the skin condition right to go. So, um, I have to get some of these meds from home. And just filling in the forms were like just such a painful reality for me that my child has a skin disorder, my child has chronic medication. And you know, you have to declare it on the forms, you know, just from being healthy to clicking to, to I mean, writing not, not applicable like NA, NA on forms. It's bizarre, honestly. But I'm grateful to God that He's in good hands, that He's smiling, He's laughing, and but He's sleeping now, which is great. And we'll see Him tomorrow. Can you say, Karila? Say sorry. Pray for Carolo. Pray for Carolo. Hi. Aww. Mm. Thank you, Kanya. Thank you, my baby. Say I love you, Carolo. Blow a kiss to Carolo. Blow a kiss, Mama. Blow mm. a kiss. Oh. Don't cry. Mm. 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 Yes, mm. 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 Say I love you, Letty. Mm. We love you, my baby. Mommy loves you. Don't cry, my baby. Mm -hmm. Mommy loves you, ne? I'm sorry. And I love you, ne? Mommy's praying for you. We are all praying for you. Everything's going to be okay. You are in a very good hospital. And the surgery is going to go well. Okay? Remember to keep praying, ne? Love you. Love you. Love you. Bye. 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 Love. Hey, bye. 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 <laughs> be, be, be good, my boy, okay? Okay. Good morning, my loves. Um, I hope you're well. This is the day that the Lord has made, and we will rejoice and be glad in it. I'm in the car just waiting for my sister. We're going to the hospital. And, um, yeah, as you can see, my face, this was the eye that was swollen last time, and now it's starting on this side. I've got a swelling face, but that's that doesn't bother me at all. Like I'm over it. Um, 
with my heart my prayers are with my son he's going in for surgery at two o'clock and now the time is 11 so i'm just going to spend time with him before that he's doing so well i'm grateful to god and um but what the reason i'm recording this video is that when you when when the enemy comes to attack um me and just the tests that i've been going through the struggles that i've been going through with my health and everything that's fine i can handle it i can fight it and i think i frustrated the enemy so much because i managed to always find a place a way and to just praise god every single day to wake up and see goodness and mercy like above my struggles and my problems for the fact that i, I don't worship i don't dwell on negativity like even when um it affects my work it affects my family I still stand strong and still believe that God is, my, God is my savior and give him thanks every day. This is why I said, this is the day that the Lord has made. I still see so much mercy and grace and blessing upon this day, even through what I'm, go, uh, where, what I'm going through. So, um, yeah. So now when the enemy starts attacking me through my children, then I know that it's personal. It's, it's, it's a personal attack. Now, I take out my mom clothes. Now it's like, okay, I'm ready for war. I'm ready to do this. You, you want to go to the battlefield? Let's do this. I've heard about, you know, a praying mother. I've, I've seen praying mothers. I've, you know, but I never, I don't think I've prayed the way I've prayed. I don't think I've fought the way I've fought. And maybe that's a place that God wanted me to be so desperately. You know, maybe just God just wanted me to meet him there. I don't know what it is, but I am feeling stronger now more than ever. I am ready for this battle. I am fighting. I am praying. I am worshiping God. I'm giving God the glory. I, yeah. Okay, this is my sister calling me. Okay, I think she's done. But yeah, basically that's, that's the, that's, the, that's what I wanted to say to you guys. Oh. This is so painful. I don't want to scratch it because it's gonna be it's gonna swell up and be inflamed. Let me just go into the house and fetch my sister and then head over to the hospital. Pray for us, pray for me, pray for my family. And if you're also facing struggles, I would encourage you to stay put, to stay strong. I know it's hard. And I know how we you know yeah. Stay put, stay strong. God is still on the throne, God is good. Okay, my sister's done. Say hello. Hello. How are you doing? I've been waiting for you in the house, but not for that long. No, I just came like five minutes ago yeah. just to record the video. Okay, cool. How are you feeling? Mm. Today, hey mommy, okay. are you all prayed up? I'm prayed up. I'm positive. I'm just waiting for my son to come out strong and heal. Yeah. 
Mm -hmm. My thigh is, is sore, not your thigh. Because mm -hmm. they took skin from your thigh. That's why your thigh is sore. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Can you drink some juice? Mm -hmm. That's why your thigh is sore. Because they needed skin to cover here from your thigh. Alright? Because you, you don't have enough skin. I put a skin bread. Mm -hmm. Faithful with your word. Thank you for being faithful, Heavenly Father, to your promises. Thank you for being faithful to us as your children. You are a good and a mighty God. Thank you. Hey buddy, uh, it's Papa here. Love you very much. I was really heartbroken when I heard what happened and when I saw you at the hospital. Um, I never want to see you in pain. You know, um, sometimes you look as a parent and you know, seeing the pain that you're in, seeing how you're looking, I sit down and I wish that was me, you know, instead of you. But now that you are here, I want to say that may, may you heal and may this be your story, may this be your testimony, may this be your I've been through the most moment and may you grow from this. May God elevate you and give you a story that will elevate you to greater heights and greater places. I pray that your pain may open up doors for you. Your pain may lead you places that you'd never go had it not been of the pain that you experienced, you know. But in everything, know that we love you very much. But come home, got it love. Modi mori bo kawe na mo di mo ri bo kawe modi mori bo kawe na mo di mo ri bo kawe na Alleluia. Amen. Alleluia. Amen. Praise be to God. Say thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Oh, oh, oh. Dimo, oh, oh. Re.